What, What is up, everyone? Welcome to Candle Play. Hello, good hearts and God sense. My name is Simon Goodheart VA, and welcome to our channel Canva Play. We make videos here in Canva Play to share Canva design tutorials, tips, tricks, and hacks that will elevate your Canva skills for free. If you are new here, be sure to subscribe and turn on your notifications just below this video so you don't miss out on every video we post here as we upload new videos all the time. All right then, let me start our today's tutorial. In today's tutorial, I am going to show you how to create a neon-lined clothes in Canva. Fluorescent or neon colors are incredibly bright versions of primary and secondary colors such as blue, red, green, yellow, and purple. Fluorescent colors stand apart from other types of color because they emit light, making them luminescent. In the 80s, people began to wear neon-colored clothes. It was all about hope. Neon colors symbolized a new mood and season of burgeoning hope across the world. Traditionally, wearing such had a safety purpose such as reflecting lights and making one visible in the dark. Still, now in our active wear era, they are making a fashion statement too. What if I want clothes that are not so bright and put some neon line in the outlines to make them luminescent? Can I make it possible? Can I do it in Canva? Yes, I can. Let's get into Canva and start creating the design. But before that, here is the design that I will create. I am now in a blank Canva design page and let's create a design. My first move is to get my subject photo from Photos. I'll get it from recently used to minimize my time of searching. The keyword of this can be searched as fashionable Asian woman on color background. In choosing an image with this kind of effect or design, you need to pick pictures that are very colorful like the photo I chose to use. I will set this photo as my background. Though this image is already very colorful to look at, I need to apply settings to enhance more its colors because colors is a big factor in creating this kind of effect. Using the image, go to Edit Image, Find Adjust, See All, and apply these settings brightness negative 15 contrast 5 saturation 30 blur negative 5 clarity 3 shadows negative 30 after i enhance the color of my image now i am going to create the neon lined clothes effect it's time to use the new Canva feature called Draw Beta. Here, you can find it in the left sidebar. In case you cannot find it, scroll down below and click More. And you can also view it at the upper part of the toolbar. To give you a little overview on this Canva app, Draw Beta lets you create unique artwork. You can draw, scribble, or sketch freehand to bring your idea to life. When you are inside the draw beta, you need to select first a brush to get started. You can see here the different brush types to use. A pen, marker, a glow pen, a highlighter brush. You can manipulate on what size, on what transparency, and on what color you want to be your drawing is all about. In this design, since I am doing a neon lined clothes effect, obviously, I will use the glow pen. So I will select the glow pen. For the size, I'll change the default 50 to 15. For the transparency, it sets in 100. So I won't change that anymore because I need the maximum transparency measurement. The first line effect that I'm going to draw is on the clothes. 
Here, the lady's clothes color is green and to make the line more obvious and beautiful to look at, I need to choose a color that is in the same shades of green and brighter than the, sol than the solid green she wears. So, I will choose the neon green with the hex code. Type in here, number sign 85FF02. Now, watch carefully because I need to make my hand steady to draw the lines on the lady's clothes. I am now done drawing the clothes outlines. I will click done and see how I draw the outlines using the glow pen from the Draw Beta app. I want to draw also the line of her yellow hat which it seems will add a beautiful look when I get this design done. Same steps. Now we're in the Draw Beta app here already. Select again the glow pen. Adjust the size to 15 and transparency to 100 and this time I will not use the neon green. I will use the orange color here to complement the yellow hat and the yellow background of the picture. After I finish the drawing of outlines, I will click Done. Did you see the neon lines I draw? It's very colorful to look at, but I need to make it brighter. I want it to be more colorful, enhanced, and more obvious. To achieve what I want, I need to apply an effect onto these neon lines, and I can do it by using the first effect we featured here in Canva Play, which is called Realistic Glow Effect. If you can't remember it anymore, then let's recall and do it on these neon lines we got here. Using the neon line I draw on the clothes, go to Edit Image and find Shadows. Click See All and select the Glow Shadow. Change the settings to Size 3, Transparency 100. Blur 11 and change the color. Use the same color I use using the hex code number sign 85FF02. Then click apply after. Using the same outlines. Now, go to Edit Image again and find instead of Shadows, the Color Mix feature. Click See All and under See All, find Glow. Change the settings to Strength 0.5, Size 10, Cut Off 0.4, then click Apply. I will apply the same settings to the outlines I draw in her hat, so I will repeat the same process. Select the hat, go to Edit Image, Find Shadows, click See All, select Glow, change the settings to Size 3, Transparency 100, Blur 11, and this time change the color to the color I used on her outline, which is the orange one. Click Apply.
using the same outlines, go to edit image once more. Scroll down and find color mix. See all. Find glow. Under it, change the settings to strength 0 0.5, size 10, cut off 0 0.4, and click apply. Did you see how the outlines became lively, more bright, enhanced, and shines? That's what a realistic glow effect is. After this, I will select the two and lock them. I'm almost done. To put a highlight on this design, I will add another element that I think it can add more light to this. Go to Elements. Search for the keyword light frame texture. Hit enter. And I will choose the fourth one in the list with the keyword light frame texture. Use and drag it in the design. I will rotate this element 90 degrees. And I will stretch it to occupy the whole page like this. And lock it. This is now the final look of the design I created using the neon lined clothes effect in Canva. That's it! For more design inspirations, watch this. If you like this video, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and to be updated with our upcoming videos, click subscribe. Drop your comments below for the tutorial you want to learn next time. Before I end this video, I hope I inspire your creativity. I'm Simon Goodhart VA saying, sharing is caring. In behalf of Pinky Godsent VA, thank you for watching this till the end. Don't forget to hit that little bell icon so you don't miss the next video from Pinky with another exciting Canva tutorial. Bye guys, see you in the next video.